continue on with our discussions about dates here. So in the previous video, we talked about how to take a separate value for month, year, and day, and then combine that into a cell as a date. In this video, we're going to go the opposite way. So I'd like to take the month and extract it from a date and the year and the day. So here's what this looks like. You have a function called equals month, open bracket. Then you would pick the date. So in this case, it would be D2. So equals month, open bracket, D2, close bracket, hit enter. And as you can see, it extracts the month. No problem. As you may have guessed, there is one called year, which will be set up pretty much the exact same way. Equals year, open bracket, then the date cell, close bracket. There we go. And then you also have one called day. And you can grab the date cell just like we did before. It's gonna grab the day. So, not only can we put separate pieces, month, year, day, and put them together in a, to a date, which we saw in the previous video, but in this video, we can also take a date, existing date, and break it apart into its individual pieces of month, year, and day.